All right, you're welcome to my screen, and I'm going to walk you through how to set up your seller account perfectly as an affiliate. Now you can see here on my email, I've already received an email that I have been made an affiliate. This is exactly the same email you will receive once they make you an affiliate on any product on seller. Do you understand? So you receive this type of email. So all you need to do is to scroll down. You see where they wrote activate your seller account, right? This is the place you click to activate your seller account. But before then, scroll down to this point. See where your affiliate link is, right? If you click on this affiliate link, it is going to take you to that same product that the owner of that product gave you. Now, this is the product. Do you understand? This is the product. If anybody use this, your link, to purchase this product that is selling for 10500 uh, you are going to get 50% of the money. Do you understand? So this is your affiliate link. Let's copy this link before going to activate our seller account. Now, you come, you tap on Google Docs, you kind of create a new document where you now save your affiliate link. You just come here, you type affiliate link, my affiliate link, affiliate link. Just type something like my affiliate link. As simple as that, so that you remember my affiliate link. Save it so that you remember it. My affiliate link you come here you tap and hold the screen and you see where the road to paste you paste this this is your affiliate link anytime someone use this link to, to purchase a product you are going to get commission now let's go back to activating your account because your account may not be active if you have been made an affiliate so what you tap is here activate your seller account so it is going to load and sometimes if you already have a seller account they will tell you that this email has been used what you do is to request for a change of password but if your own shows like if they tell you that this email has been used or is already in use you need to just put the email and the request for change of password they will send you a new password you put it and you have your account completely but if they have not sent you if they are not telling you that this email has been used they are going to show you a profile like this are you seeing it they're going to show you a profile like this. So what you're going to do is to put your full name. You're going to put your full name. So I'm going to type Kingsley Nemeka here. And then type password. Let's just say 2311. 2311. Star 12. This password. I'm not using this account so you you can see the password i'm just using it to teach so this password has been created when you tap complete profile so now when you tap on this complete profile it is going to take you to another page probably your dashboard this is how the page will look like it will look like this now for some people at this place they will tell you to verify your email yeah if you don't verify, if they are telling you to verify your email here and you didn't verify it, seller will hold your money once you make sales. If you don't verify your name, if they say verify your email here and you don't verify it, they will hold your money once you make sales. You will see the money written on hold. Now, you can see this is affiliate dashboard. You see all links. These all links, if you tap this one, it is going to open and you will see the name of the product owner. The person that made you a product that's how they told they wrote added by merchant this is the product owner this is the product owner it doesn't necessarily have to be that the person is is, is the person's link so you can you can slide like this you see your commission is 50 and then you see that same link we copied is here this is your link this is your link do you understand so this is your link if you tap on it you will see where they wrote all these things you see where they wrote copy link text copy link text or copy link address anyone and then you copy it save it in google docs so that you are going to use it anytime somebody wants to make a sale to close more sales and then secondly you are going to come to wallet and payout this wallet should be reading zero by all means this wallet should be reading zero there's no money to withdraw yet because you have just been made an affiliate, you should be reading no record yet.
hi family my name is kingsley nemeka and yes this is my youtube channel i just need your support by subscribing to this youtube channel turning on the notification bell icon so that anytime i upload a very powerful video like this you will be notified first to come and see what we have and secondly i also want you to like this video by the time you like this video that's the only way people can engage in it and it reach wider audience who may be looking forward to learn the same thing you are learning right now thank you very much for doing that for me continue watching the video as you continue learning so what you are going to do is simple you go to home and then if they ask you to verify your email please verify it in all these uh, access affiliate marketplace don't touch it because they are going to ask you to pay three thousand naira a year for you to access other affiliate platform so you don't have anything to do with that if you tap on get started it is going to load and then they will request for three thousand naira. you don't need it you've already been made an affiliate by someone so all you have to do is to quietly go to that place where the person have made you an affiliate copy the link like i said in your email save when you enter your seller account you are going to just start your marketing now for instance let's just log into seller from here come to your browser you tap seller.co you come down here to log in to that uh very very page you just created you see it have logged in so the next thing you do is to set up your payment details so you click on set up your payment details these things i'm telling you is what you will do some of you will go and be doing other things and be and be looking for add product you don't have to add product do you understand yes so you see when you want to set your bank you see what they said set up your bank details this is where your funds will be paid to after you make your first sale or affiliate sale you will require to complete your kyc and set your government details before you can withdraw your funds are you seeing it are you seeing it so this your kyc should be your id card or your bvn Mostly they will ask for BVN because it has to do with the bank. So if you're a Nigerian, you pick your country and pick the bank you want to use. Do you understand? Once you do it, you verify the account. They will request, they will request for your password and you just put it. And that is all. Every other thing you are going to be doing on seller is when you make a sale, you will log in and see your, your, your dashboard reflect. Do you understand? You see your dashboard reflect you see your dashboard reflect so i don't want you to get confused ever again after this please don't get confused by anything let let nothing confuse you after going through this this is exactly how to set your profile on seller as an affiliate remember the first thing to do is to receive an email now when you receive the email you copy the link and save somewhere because every time you tell someone to buy a product, you're going to need that email. And then you tap on activate your account. When you tap on activate it, you go. Some of you don't use to tap on this activate. That is why they used to even say verify your email. So activate it. Once you activate it, you go to seller. It will open. You put your name and your password. Once you put your name and password, that is the name and the password you'll be needing every time you want to log into seller and then when you want to log into seller you just come to seller.co type seller.co it will load and you log in to this very page that you have just created and when you log in you are going to set up your payment details and then know that you don't have anything to do with anything called access affiliate marketplace you don't have anything to do with it and you don't also have anything to do with ad products. Don't scroll up here. Don't tap start selling. Don't tap on start selling. You understand? Don't tap on start selling. You don't have anything to do with it. You don't have any, the only thing you're going to set is copy your link, verify your email by activating it, and set up your payment account. That link is what you're going to be using. Don't forget to verify your email here if they are saying verify here. Do you understand? So please. This is how to set your seller account as an affiliate. And I believe you, are, you have learned from it. Don't forget to subscribe to this YouTube channel. Thank you very much for watching. And do where to share with someone who may be looking forward to, to watch this same video and learn from it.
Thank you very much, family, for watching that video. I believe you watched that video and you really enjoyed it. And I believe you've gotten some lessons from that. Don't forget to like this video and share this video to a friend. I want to invite you to our Telegram channel where we always share updates on a daily basis for you to learn more things even when you're not on YouTube. This will help us to always reach out to you anytime we want you to have something we learn together. Imagine where people of like minds are gathered. It's a place you want to be. So if you are looking forward to join us, click the link in the description of this video and join us immediately. Thank you for watching.